Twice definitely has some of the prettiest ladies in the group. Anyone would be lucky to call these talented and kind-hearted beauties theirs. Though, as we all know, dating in the industry is not that common. But fear not, even they experience some love. Today, I'm gonna tell you all about the boys that were lucky enough to date the members of Twice, or at least were thought to do that. Jihyung there were never really any rumors about Jihyo and her dating life apart from one confirmed relationship. In August 2019, Dispatch revealed that Jihyo and soloist Kang Daniel were dating. They were seen together on a date in Hangnang neighborhood. The two started seeing each other at the beginning of 2019 after being introduced by their mutual friend from the industry. Both of their agencies later confirmed this. Though not many people were suspecting this, most of the reactions were positive. After the news got out, Daniel wrote a letter to his fans in which he said, I'm really sorry to everyone who may have been surprised when they saw the sudden news. I'm very sorry because I couldn't say it beforehand. Honestly, there was no need for an apology, but at least he shows he truly loves his fans. Unfortunately, the pair broke up last year. Apparently, it was because of their busy schedules, but who knows where the truth lies. Hopefully, they're just both happy now. Chongyoung Like every other member of TWICE, even Chongyoung is private about her relationships. She previously said that she prefers a guy who makes her comfortable and who is funny. Though she wasn't officially in any relationships, there were some rumors. So usually, when dating rumors start, it's because idols steal glances at each other and they look all smiley and look in love. But this is not the case between her and Park Jimin. Actually, it's quite the opposite. Every time Chongyun and Jimin attend the same shows, the talk about what happened between them comes up. All of the shady looks they threw at each other made fans believe that they had some kind of feud. Over the years, there have been a lot of theories about what actually happened between these two, but the most common theory was that they once dated and ended their relationship on bad terms. One popular moment happened on Music Bank when BTS and TWICE were interviewed at the same time. The boys started singing their song Spring Day and the girls joined them. However, in the end, Jongyun sang loudly and and Jimin looked at her like she did something terrible. The same thing happened backstage when Twice were watching BTS's performance and once Jimin appeared on screen, all the girls were smiling except Jonghyun. Even though it sounds pretty serious, fans decided to turn this into a joke and it became something to laugh about. Another rumor of Jonghyun dating, actor Kim Min Seok started when the two of them and Jonghyun's sister Songyun were MCs for Music Bank. Fans started noticing the chemistry between Jonghyun and Min Seok and how naturally they acted with each other and started shipping them. Min Seok even revealed that Jonghyun is his ideal type. However, this was just a rumor. Sana being an extrovert with a lot of friends, it just takes a few interactions with any male and the rumors just start coming. Honestly, some fans should consider working for the FBI because they notice every single detail and nothing gets past them. The speculations about Sana dating someone started after both Sana and Suho posted pictures on their Instagram from the same place. People believe they were together as they also posted the picture in the same month, just on different days. This was not the only time they did something like this though. Sana once posted a pic of her with the caption, do you like it? And fans pointed out that Suho shared a pic of him with the caption, I like it. But this was later debunked as the pictures uploaded by Sana were posted a month later after Suho's. There were also times when both of them were seen wearing the same clothes, but if you were rooting for this pair to be true, I'm sorry to disappoint you, but it was never confirmed. Being from the same agency always makes the spread of rumors easier as there are usually far more interactions. In 2017, Sana played a girlfriend in the music video of Junho's song called Instant Love. Considering that was the first time we saw Sana acting, fans were surprised by how believable their relationship looked. Because of that, many believe that there might have been something real going on behind the scenes. Also, this was not the only time when she made an appearance in his videos. She spoke in his Japanese song Candy too. Sana was also seen attending one of Junho's concerts in her free time. After all, both of them are good friends, so no wonder why they looked comfortable around each other. Nayan with how beautiful Nayan is, you would think that she has been in multiple relationships, but no, and if she was, she's pretty good at hiding them. Her ideal type is someone she can depend on and someone she can trust, and that someone might have been BTS's Chon Jungkook. After both groups attended the idol school athletic championship in 2015, some fans started to get suspicious of these two. One of the disciplines that Nayan participated in was wrestling. Jungkook didn't take his eyes off her during the whole match, and from his reactions, you can tell he was rooting for her to win. And when she actually won, he looked pretty proud of her. I mean, seeing his reactions, no one fans started believing that there was something going on between them. Other than that, fans also claimed that Jungkook got nervous around Nayeon when both of them were guest stars in Flower Crew. But as these rumors were neither denied nor confirmed, we can all only speculate if there was ever something going on between them. The other guy she was speculated to be dating was Yi Min Hyuk from B2B. Back in 2016, Nayeon and Min Hyuk did a mini show called Oh My God Tip, where they acted like a couple and gave some tips on how to act in different situations. They both looked comfortable around each other and at one point, they almost kissed. Although I must admit, they looked pretty good as a couple it was probably all just really good acting skills. Mina. 
Mina was amongst the first members of the group that had any dating scandals. Though nothing was ever confirmed to be true, it was so wild. If you've been a fan for a while, you probably didn't miss this affair. The whole situation was kind of ridiculous. It all started with a picture posted of them on social media back in 2017. In the picture, it looked like they were lying on a bed together, but to be fair, that didn't really mean anything. Some fans started saying that Sana and Bam Bam are dating each other, and others were saying that the picture was just edited. However, JYP later released a statement where they confirmed that the picture was indeed real, but the two of them were nothing but friends. After that, there was no other rumors about these two. As much as I'd like to know if there was ever anything more between them, we gotta respect their privacy. Mom Except for one confirmed relationship, there were never really any rumors about Momo dating anyone. The first rumor about Momo and Hito dating started in August of 2019, when it was reported that the two of them had been dating for two years. However, both of their agencies released a statement denying this. That's why it was a shock to everyone when in January of 2020, the rumor of them dating appeared again. But this time, the agencies confirmed it. While some fans showed concerns over the 13 years age difference, the majority were happy about the news and shared the congratulations. The couple has just recently announced that they broke up and ended their relationship. When it comes to Dahyun's dating life, there's really not much we know. There hasn't been anyone that the public knows of, but with how fans like to ship idols, of course, even Dahyun has some dating rumors. People started saying that there might be something going on between Dahyun and Unu after they got together to make a short clip on NPC's The Imaginarium. It was basically a short parody of a K-drama where they start as a couple in the making. Fans started to look more into this couple, especially after they saw the behind the scenes of the video. Apparently, they were flirting together while filming and all in all looked comfortable with each other. After the filming, they got together to discuss the whole experience and found out they had a few things in common. When they found out they went to the same high school, Una suggested that they should speak casually to each other and suggested she call him Opa. When they tried speaking without any honorifics, they were all shy and cute about it. Tail. Taeyong was a victim of only one messed up dating rumor. Back in November of 2020, a picture of what was apparently Taeyong and Shim Hwasa, who was a famous tattoo artist, was shared on the internet. The picture was taken in a shop, but since both of them had their backs toward the camera, it's hard to say if it was really them. The reason why people started even speculating was a white hat. It was the same hat she showed and said was her favorite on a talk show called Radio Star. The color of her hair at the time also matched the one in the picture. Some people even claimed they saw the couple out in public, but who knows if we can believe that. Fans immediately went to look at his Instagram page which was later deleted. One of the pictures he shared was a drawing featuring a girl with a mole on the side of her face, exactly in the same place as Cheyong's mole. They were also seen wearing identical rings and people started to speculate that these were couple rings. Many people showed their concerns and were not happy about her dating him, especially because he was older than her and allegedly threatened to release footage of drunk Cheyong if people kept threatening him about their relationship. JYP shared a statement but all they said was, we do not have an official stance regarding Cheyong's dating rumors. I think it's cool of them to actually respect their artist's personal life and not comment on it any further. So you. As the youngest member of the group, and considering she debuted at the age of 16, there's really no knowledge of her dating someone. She is looking for someone who would be nice to her family and friends, and he also has to love dogs. Those are pretty easy qualities to have, right? That's probably why people started to like the idea of BTS's V and Suyu dating. Honestly, the whole thing between Suyu and V is more of a wishful thinking for some fans. Since they don't have any actual direct interactions with each other, people try to make up stuff on their own, from them apparently staring at each other at award shows to them uploading pictures around the same time. People try to connect anything similar these two do. The dedication shows just how much fans really want these two to be a thing. I mean, if it came to it, I'm all for it, but so far, it's not real. So what do you guys think? Should we expect some more confirmed couples or do you think the girls are single? Let us know in the comments and until next time, bye!